not yet identified the source of the outbreak, but they do think it may be linked to sushi. Well, Congressman Paul Ryan is the Republican Party's budget expert, and he was in Milwaukee today talking about his plan to cut spending and reform the tax code. Of course, if you're a politician in Wisconsin these days, you can't go along before you start talking about the recall. Fox 6 Mike Lowe joining us now with the political lowdown for tonight. Mike. Good evening, Brad. If you asked a good politician what race they thought was most important, I'm willing to bet nine times out of ten they'd tell you it's the one they're personally running it. So that's why it was so interesting to hear Congressman Paul Ryan, who is, after all, up for re-election in November, give a different answer to that question. This is the second most important election in the country next to the presidential election, uh, Scott's recall election. Congressman Paul Ryan says Governor Scott Walker's recall election trumps everything but the presidential race. You say recall Walker! Because the recall's impact extends beyond the Badger State's borders. Most folks in, in D.C. look at this election as a national trend-setting election. Ryan was in Milwaukee talking about his budget plan to business leaders, but the conversation soon turned to the recall. And it's basically courage is on the ballot. Ryan's Democratic opponent in the 1st Congressional District agrees the recall is important, to the point that it's sapping resources from other races. In Wisconsin, you know, you talk to donors and they, they say, look, uh, I'm really supporting the recall effort right now, so I think after the recall is done, there will be much more of a focus on, on our our elections this November. Experts say outside groups, including political action committees and labor unions, could spend $100 million in Wisconsin trying to win the Walker race. It's, it's definitely a referendum on Walker's misplaced agenda and misplaced priorities. And Ryan says the outcome of that referendum has the potential to cast a long shadow over American politics for years to come. If Scott Walker or these state senators get recalled in June, what governor or state legislature in the future is going to take on these big structural challenges? What, what, what politician in state government is going to take on these entrenched special interest groups and deal with the structural problems of their state if this is what happens to you? And so that's why the stakes are so high. And Paul Ryan says he will play an active role in the recall races. He says he'll campaign with Walker and the senators under recall. Zurbin says the congressman should focus on the first district and not statewide and national politics. Brad, and back to you. Mike, thank you. New tonight, we have some new details about the potential criminal.